Hey, it's Carrie. This video is for viewers age 13 plus. Tiger. To attract males, the females make frequent and repetitive vocalizations, as well as leaving odorous excretions. They need to build up trust necks, and while they're growling, they come closer to each other and then separate, and then back again and separate. Finally, they stay together and the female begins to caress the male with her snout and even lick and groom him. She then lies face down, indicating that she is ready. The male grabs her by the scruff of the neck for balance and also so she can't get away. For the tigress, copulation is a painful act since the tiger's penis has barbs. Copulation is brief and repeated frequently to induce ovulation. This is a new tiger. Cubs are born after a gestation period of about three and a half months. Lion. Their manes make the males look larger and may help intimidate rivals or even impress prospective females. Young male lions, when about two years old, are forced out of the pride by the other males. Mating opportunities for nomad males are rare and competition between male lions to defend the pride's territory and mate with the pride's females is fierce. This usually happens when they're a little older. Cooperating partnerships of two to four males are more successful at maintaining tenure within a pride than individual lions. Larger coalitions father more surviving offspring per male. If a new cohort of males is able to take over a pride, they will seek to kill the young cubs side by their predecessors to shorten the time before the cubs mothers are ready to mate again. Leopard. Body size and colour patterns of leopards varies geographically and probably reflects adaptions to particular habitats, things like camouflage. Leopards are facultative drinkers and obtain much of their water requirements from the prey they ingest. Leopards are strong and have a lot of stamina. They will tackle prey up to 10 times their own weight. The leopard's scapula or shoulder blades have specialised attachment sites for climbing muscles. Black leopards are most populous in humid forests. Savannah and woodland leopards tend to be relatively large while mountain and desert leopards tend to be relatively small. Rhinoceros they tend to wallow in the mud, which serves as a cooling technique and insect repellent and sun protection. White rhinos are surprisingly agile and can run very fast, up to 40 kilometers per hour for short periods. They have poor eyesight, but acute senses of hearing and smell. Their horns are used as weapons against predators and for dominance and threat displays in contact with other rhinos. The southern white horn has the largest front horn growing to 2 metres in length. The great Indian rhinoceros has a body length of up to 3.8 metres and a shoulder height up to 1.86 metres. Average 
weight would be 2,200 kilograms, but you can get much larger ones. Please stay on and watch another video with me. I love to read your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.